In this episode, we're going to take a look at how to set up the Chrome Remote Desktop, so let's get started. Getting the Chrome Remote Desktop to work is actually pretty easy. You're just going to need to make sure that you have two computers. Uh, as of the date of this video, there's unfortunately no way to use a tablet or an Android device or an iOS device or even a Windows mobile device at this moment in order to do that. But in another video, I'll show you how to remote desktop into your computer from your well, I'm going to be doing it from an Android device. But for this video, we're going to go ahead and get the Chrome Remote Desktop installed. So to do that, you're going to need to head over to the Chrome Web Store. Now you will need to have the Chrome Desktop, or sorry, the Chrome Browser installed. I'll have a link for that in the description, as well as a link how to get to the Chrome Remote Desktop application. So once you have that installed, you're going to need to install it on both the computers that you'll be doing it on. And then you'll just go ahead and open it up and you're going to be greeted to a screen like this. So what you're going to need to do is with the screen that you're going to want to share, you're going to come up here and you're going to click the share button. And then on the computer that you're going to want to work from, you're going to click the access button. So when I click share, it's going to generate an access code. My access code is found right here. I have it blocked off for security reasons. And then once you have that, you're going to then open up your other computer and click the access and you're going to hit that access code. And once you do that, you are going to have full control of your computer. So as you can see, this is what the window looks like once you've uh, logged in and you've remotely started sharing. Now this is going to be the screen for the viewer. So I'm actually looking into another computer. It's actually a Chromebook too. And uh, what you do need to know about this is the fact that the computer that you're look going to look into needs to have a certain file downloaded. Now what I'll do is I'll actually come up here and I'll hit this little pull down menu. I'll go to screen options, I'll go to full screen. Now this looks like I'm completely in my other computer. So this applications menu that I'm going to is actually gonna be a part of my other computer. This nav bar on the bottom is as well. Because what you'll see now is I'll pull out a full screen and you'll see I have my nav bar on the bottom and I have that nav bar which is the other computer right there. Just full screen makes it look like so it takes over everything. But what you do need to know is once you come into the Chrome Remote Desktop app in the Chrome Web Store, you're going to need to download this dev file right here. And it'll, then as soon as you've downloaded it, you can just double click it and it'll open up in your software center and you can just install it. Uh, you only need it on the computer that you're going to be looking into. The computer that you're going to be using to look with, you don't need to have that actually installed. You just need to have uh, the Chrome web browser and then this Chrome remote desktop application installed. And that's about it. So it's extremely easy to do. Uh, just make sure that you do s the password or the passcode that you're going to need. Make sure you save that and don't let other people see that, otherwise they'll be able to uh, get into your computer. So for security reasons, um, if you do have any questions about that, as always, ask them in the section below. And uh, thanks for watching.